Hey everyone, welcome back to another The Maury's Place Let's Play of Animal Crossing New Leaf. And I've just noticed, literally as we started, we have an absolutely gorgeous aurora in the sky. I don't know if it's always like that or if there's a double one there or something, but that looks absolutely awesome. Um, you don't often get to see these, they're actually pretty rare, I think. Um, especially in the, well, they're rare in New Horizons as well, but I'm pretty sure they're... Tough to spot in New Leaf as well because you have to be playing quite late, which we are. We're playing super late because we're going. <gasps> no way! The Rossetti Public Works thing. Can we go in? Let's try. Oop. Don't mind us just jumping straight in. And oh, it is Rossetti. Is anyone else here before we disturb him? Oh, it's the toilet. Don't mind me just pooping in the Rossetti layer. And we didn't even flush. Hey. Hey, how do you get in here? I don't care if you are the mayor. This place is off limits. No exceptions. Look, kid, this is the place where people do work. It's not some playpen for you to walk in and drool on everything. You know what this job takes? I gotta stay alert. Be ready to go any time of the day or night, any day of the year. You know what I do on my birthday? This. I work. At the same time, I've got to keep my mind and body relaxed. It helps me be a whole cool cucumber for when things do go down, which they will. I spent 30 whole years perfecting that delicate balance. It's an art. Sometimes <laughs> part of that is chilling out watching TV and you're getting in the way. Oh, I'm so sorry. But yeah, you don't get to come in here often. This is super cool. I don't think there's anything that's interactive down here. Um, whoa, pizza! Cool, can I sit in the chair? I can't even sit in these, what is it, like a command center massage chair or something? But all we can do is sit on the toilet. <laughs> can we do a reaction? <laughs> okay, that's so cool. It opened, uh, uh, excuse me, it only opens randomly, so there's never, you never can tell when you're going to come in here. You're not getting going to find nothing, so quit snooping around. Okay, well, we might be back later. Um, but yes, as I was saying before we were rudely interrupted by Rossetti's... Oh no, we can't go back in! It's shut now! Before we were interrupted, I was saying it's late at night because... Well, it's late at night, and we're going to go to the tropical island. Oh no, our snowman is melting. We're going to go to the tropical island and do some bug catching, I think, because um, we've missed the turnips. The turnips were, could only be this morning. We didn't have much luck on them this week, so just double check there's no one in the plaza. Uh, oh, what's going on over here? Two fossils in one. Awesome. Um, yeah, we haven't had much luck on hay inkwell on the um, turnips, so I felt like... Maybe someone had a good idea in the comments that we should do some late night bug catching But before we do that, we have got some things to sell So I thought we could harvest the fruit as well um, So we might as well pick up a whole bunch of fruit because we need to start paying off our house debts um, And just get more public works projects. Hopefully Isabel's awake, which I'm sure she is the hard worker and Maybe we can organize a new public work project as well but I figured late night bug catching might yield us more bells than the uh, the turnips have been. Hey, Reese, do you guys ever sleep? Actually, I think you I think you close soon. Actually, so we better be careful. We don't want to miss the uh, closing time. So we want to just sell all these yummy mangoes and a bunch of fossils we found yesterday and some unwanted gifts. Shh! Don't tell the villagers. Uh, you can get away with it if you don't list them for sale in here. Uh, is that everything then? I'll start crunching the numbers right away. Well then, I could probably part with 20,220 bells. Deal. That's a good deal. Uh, thank you, come back with more anytime you like. We will because we need to buy some more Astro stuff because we want Cyrus to customize lots of Astro furniture. Thank you. Okay, I guess we should get to bug hunting because if we waste too much time catching the f uh, picking up the fruit we might miss the uh, the cutoff point for the shop because I think it shuts soon um, so we might as well head down to Capin. where's the ramp there it is <laughs> um, just double check Gulliver's not on this beach real quick 
I don't think he'd be here on a Sunday anyway, but... Oh, I forgot how long this beach was. <laughs> Look at all the bananas. It's going to take forever to pick all these up. Uh, we are getting slack and behind. Very lazy. Okay. Hopefully, Captain's not asleep. What's that? If you want to head to the island, it'll be 1,000 bells per round trip. Yes, please. Ah, oh, good deal. Leave it to me. Say now, me wee crab cruncher. What do you plan on spending time... Or who do you plan on spending time with on the island? Uh, no one. Just us for now. Uh, you can't bring your effects onto the island, so I'll just be holding on to them for you. Of course, that's okay. Uh, don't worry yourself, none. Most of your stuff probably still be here when you get back. Well then, hop on me boat by gar. Okay, we can get a net off Lloyd when we get there for the bug catching, so that's okay. Um, so yeah, we'll get those super quick, hopefully. There we go. We made it to the island. Oh, look! An Aloha t-shirt. And a Cabana item. Wait, how many medals have we got? We've played a few games. 27 medals. Ah, Cabana screen. Oh, no! Uh, you'll be seeing a nice item there. I'll give it to you for 40 medals. No, thanks. Definitely going to have to do some more... Um, some more tours to get some more medals. I got you, lad. You'll be overwhelmed by all the exotic items. Yeah. Okay, how much is a shirt? 15. Ooh, 15. Oh, we could buy the hat. The hat is cool as well. Uh, uh, the captain's hat, 50. <gasps> We've got to buy the captain's hat, haven't we? Yaha, pleasure doing business with you. I put your souvenir in the box. Make sure it's in the box when you leave so you can take it home. Oh, can't we wear it? We want to wear it. I'm assuming we can still wear it on the boat. Hey! <laughs> okay, let's do some bug catching. We may have to... There's a, a couple of tricks you can do. Ooh, butterfly. There's a couple of tricks you can do to spawn the big bugs on the trees. Um, and that is basically chop down the trees, get rid of the bushes and things to kind of encourage the beetles to spawn on the trees. So I guess that's what we're going to do. Um, welcome, I lend out a lot of goods so you can have a blast all the way out here on the island. I'll even tell you how to use them, so don't hesitate to ask if you need some help, my special friend. I would like to borrow. Uh, I don't think we're going to fill our pockets, but we'll, for now we'll take the axe and the net and the spade. We can always drop the items actually, so we could have took them all. <laughs> here you are, my good chum. Don't worry about returning loaned items, I'll collect them before you leave on the tour or go back to town. Okay, let's grab the shovel real quick. I can't remember if we've got this butterfly. We probably should catch it, just in case. Uh, I caught an emperor butterfly. Feeling blue, your majesty? Oh, looks like we already have it. Okay, so let's dig up these. Um, and we might as well get rid of the flowers as well, just in case they... Um... Oh, I've just thought, I hope this isn't permanent. I hope these grow back. If not, that's okay. We could always plant some more, I'm sure. Um, get rid of the flowers. We need to think... Where do we get the hibiscus uh, bushes from? Because you can't steal them. Because um, when you go to dig them up, they just disappear. So... Wait, did we buy some from Leaf already, actually? <laughs> I think we might have. Oops, I missed. Okay, so we're going to get rid of these last few flowers, then chop the trees down on the island as well. As long as the axe doesn't break. Um, ooh, I've just remembered that special stumps are a thing in New Horizons, aren't they? So you can find, like, rare patterns on the stumps. <gasps> we're going to have to cut some trees down on our in our town now. Go away, butterfly. Go, 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 go. Be gone. <laughs> okay, and we want to get rid of these bottom trees as well because sometimes if a bug is on there, you end up scaring it off approaching it. So we're just going to get rid of these. Three probably should do it. And then that will leave us with, what's that? Three either side, is it? Okay, cool. Oh no, four that side. Uh, we can get rid of this one as well. We've got one, two, three, four on this side. Cover some of these holes up. And basically... Wait, is there an odd number of trees? Four this side. 
for this island. I had no idea there were so many trees on uh, on this island. But yeah, so this kind of forces the beetles to spawn on the trees, the banana trees on either side of the island. So they're a bit more approachable. You're less likely to find butterflies and like dragonflies and things. So a night time is the best time. I don't know if we're late enough, but it is like it's gone 10 o'clock. So nearly 11 o'clock actually. So we need to... We need to hopefully find some beetles anyway. Okay, so the best thing to reset is go in and out. This should reset the spawn. So if we grab the net, be prepared. Hopefully we're gonna see some bugs. I don't know if they come out so late. So nothing on that tree. Oh no, I, I, I thought we were gonna see loads. Oh, there's all these sand things. But we did get. A hermit crab! Finally, it came out of its shell! I wonder what my encyclopedia says! Um, so we want to make some money off these bugs. Those annoying sand roaches. <gasps> Yay, a beetle! Uh, but we also need to make sure we donate the ones to the museum. Oh, there's a shark over there! Uh, I caught a goliath beetle. Ha, he doesn't look so big. I wonder what my encyclopedia says about my new catch. Okay, we're going to have to get the uh, fishing rod as well. I thought we were going to focus on bug hunting, but we can't really turn down a shark. Welcome, I lend out lots of goods. Yes, we understand. Can we please grab the fishing rod? Um, there we go. Okay, so we could probably drop the um, axe and the shovel now. Okay, let's uh, see if we can get this shark. Where was it? Oh, it's all the way at the top here. So sharks or big fish are normally big bucks as well. Oh no. Fishing is so hard in New Leaf. Oh no, it got away. Oh no. Hopefully we see some more. That was so quick. Oh, here we go. Oh wow, they're so quick. I very nearly missed that one. A hammerhead shark! I caught a hammerhead shark. I really nailed it. I wonder what my encyclopedia says about my new catch. That's awesome. I thought we were going to get more bugs, but I guess it's mostly fish. <laughs> this late at night. Lots of crabs. <gasps> I oh, there's another bug! I've just had an idea. If we dig a bunch of holes around the beach, it should stop the crab spawning as well. Yay! What's this one? A, a horned atlas. I like a. It's like a weight that has been lifted. Very clever. Uh, I wonder what my encyclopedia says about my catch. Okay, so. Oh, I haven't got the shovel anymore. No. Oh, this is going to be a lot of work to stop. Um... Oh, my goodness. I don't know if we can stop them, actually. They spawn on the, kind of on the beach part. We should buy, uh, we should bring loads of shells and drop all the shells. <laughs> okay, they should keep spawning from one side to the other. Hopefully, we won't have to go out in too much. Here's another one. This looks like a different one. No, I scared it away! I think it's best to come in from the side, actually. Uh, I'm just going to drop the shovel again. I don't know if we've got one of these things. So, oh, I scared it. We we might as well catch one just to double check. Um, but really, we want the big beetles. And don't the keys don't run. Here's another one. Wait, we might catch this one. Just double check if we need one of these. I caught a wharf roach. Even the beaches must be messy. Uh, it looks like we don't need the wharf roach. So, it's your lucky day. We're releasing you. <laughs> okay, so maybe a bit of an angle. There we go. So just outside the tree shadow we need to be, it looks like. 
I caught a cyclomatter stag. Need some tweezers? I don't fancy having them near me. Oh, there's another one. So now we've got one for the museum. Hopefully, if we catch this one, we'll have one to sell. I caught a cyclomatter stag. Need some tweezers? Uh, better check the time. Why isn't my clock coming up? I guess... Oh, is this a wharf as well? A uh, sand one as well? There we go. I guess it just... I guess it looks like you just need one tree on either side. Oh, no! We missed it! Uh, we only need one tree on either side of the island, it looks like. Just scare these off as we... Uh, Come through. No! That, I feel like that was a rare one because we weren't even close and it ran away. Here we go. But this is really good kind of chill time. I feel like we've had a busy week. I felt a bit rough over the weekend as well. So it's nice to... No, we did it again! It's nice to kind of just relax and catch some bugs because I definitely feel like we've caught less bugs than everything else. Like... Apart from artwork. Um, have we scared all the shells away? Or the crabs? Oh, here we go. Sneaking up. No! What is happening? I think we might have been too far away from that one. Um, oh, they're not... Oh, they're, oh, another crab here. This one spawned here. This looks like a good one. Yay! Uh, I called a horned atlas. Oh, we already—it looked different that one. Oh, what's this? Okay, here we go. Sneaking in. Try not to scare it away this time. No! This tree is unlucky. What's that? Like three or four in a row? That's just embarrassing, actually. Okay, there's another one back. This tree is a good tree, apart from we can't catch any. Whoa! I can't believe this! What is actually happening? At least we caught some. If this was the first time we were trying to catch the bugs, this would be really embarrassing. We've got lots of these little, uh... Sand ones. Oh no, where are the beetles? They're not spawning in. Maybe we're not coming far enough this side. Okay, sneak in. Oh no, there must be like a crab here somewhere. Hiding. Um, oh, we could, if we had more time, we could move all the bananas onto the... a hidden crab. We could place all the bananas on the shore and then that would stop the crab spawning in. But I feel like that's quite a lot of dedication. We seem to be having quite a bit of luck until uh, a few minutes ago. Oh. Didn't realise you could sit on the tree stumps. we catch one, maybe it will tempt the other bugs to come out. Hmm. Okay, so maybe we should have a look to see if there's any fish, because they seem to have scared all the... Ah, maybe it was that bug that was stopping them spawning. Try one more round and then we'll have a look for some fish. But we don't want to be too long actually because we want to sell a lot of these. And we need to go to the museum first. We have to donate some. Ah, here we go. Finally a bug. No, I can't believe it. I knew I wasn't close enough. 
This must be so frustrating to watch. But at least they're spawning back in again now. <laughs> Yay! We finally got one off this tree. A horned elephant. Did it get lost from the herd? Uh, at this rate, we're just going to be finding only new bugs. <laughs> but we're okay with that. Donating them is good to for the first time. We can always do this again and make more... Or catch more to make money. Here we go. Maybe we should just be more confident. We should just stroll in and go, Hey, bug. Don't mind me. Wow, that must have been so close. We must have been like a pixel away from catching that. That's unbelievable. Keep an eye on the shells. Okay, we had a good approach from here. <gasps> I can't believe it. So we need to be even closer, like to the edge of the shadow of the tree. I think it depends on what angle you come from as well. I knew one of those was a crab. Okay, maybe we'll catch, let's say catch two more bugs and then we'll head back to the mainland Donate some and sell some. Hopefully, if we have any left. But at least we got to see an aurora and also go into the reset center, which is really cool. Here we go. Two more, so let's catch this one. Yay! See, how did we miss the other one but caught that one? We're kind of above this one, but we'll take it. Yay, that's two. Okay, no new ones it looks like. We've got pretty full pockets actually anyway, so we better go and put them in the box. No more sharks it looks like. Last look for some sharks. No, I think we would see the sharks. Okay, let's put them in the box. Loving our captain's hat, by the way. <laughs> um, there we go. Okay, can I head back to town, please? Well, look who it be. Good to see you, Mori. Do you want to register for a tour or catch a boat back to Moriland? We want to go home, please. We do want to do some more tours at some point, though, because we need some more medals. Uh, you want to go home already? You be sure. I'm going back. Yeah, sorry to see you go, lad. Come on back sometime. Till next time, Mori. Oh, and here be your effects. We made it back. Um, my uh, my 3DS cut out, but we uh, on the computer, but we made it back. It's okay. Um, we've still got. Oh, we haven't picked up our bugs from the box, so we need to go back and collect those. What time is it? Oh, that's okay. We've got 10 minutes still, so before the shop shuts. Uh, item pickup box, make sure to collect your things as soon as possible. We want to take all of these. And we mustn't forget these two. Wow, we can hold a lot of stuff in here, actually. Uh, so we want to quickly run to the museum. We might as well pick up a few fossils along the way. Um, donate what we can. And then sell the rest. And hopefully make some some money. I mean, if you did this on a large scale, or you spent like a couple of hours doing, you can make a lot of money. These beetles are worth, some of them are worth thousands of bells. Uh, we dug up a mega tympanoid. Tympanoid. A tampanoid. And a fossil. Um, so we can hopefully find two more fossils. Have a quick search around. I always like to look up near the peach tree because sometimes one sneaks up here. Um, no, doesn't look like our tree is growing any more peaches. But I thought it, I thought it died after it grew so many. So I'm not sure what's happening with that. Oops. Oh, look, one hiding behind the flowers. They're the ones that I can never, ever spot. <laughs> I 
Look, I dug up a fossil, so we've got two. So there should be two more. I still haven't worked out if gyroids take the place of fossils or if they're in addition to fossils. Or if like one is in addition, like you can get two gyroids, but one would have been a fossil or something like that. Um, it's still funny that Rossetti kicks us out and then uh, locks us out when we leave. <laughs> Okay, keep your eyes open for another fossil. There we go. Uh, look, a, oh, a howloid. I wasn't even looking at the screen, so that was another gyroid. I don't think we can carry anymore. No, we've got full pockets now. Okay, might as well head back to... Oh, we've got some meow coupons to collect as well. Maybe I'll have a quick... Oh, I've just seen it up here. There it is. Okay, so if we could put a fossil... Oh, no, we don't want to put a fossil in there, do we? Gyroid in there, because we'll, we'll put those into storage. Oh, it's another gyroid! Wow! Three gyroids and three fossils. That's confused me even more. <laughs> okay, let's go to the museum quickly. Um... And then we'll get blathers to assess the fossils, donate some bugs and fossils, hopefully, and then go back to retail. Hey, blathers, wide awake because it is the middle of the night nearly. Uh, oh, welcome to the Moreland Museum. Hmm, how may we have service? I would like to assess a couple of fossils, but we need to be quick. Uh, otherwise, the retail is going to close, although we could sell them tomorrow. Uh, wait, oh, did we only have two fossils in the end? Two fossils and three gyroids. I'm so confused. Two's better than none. Uh, oh, more than one I see. Let's take a closer look. Come on. Oh, I do believe I found something that's not yet part of... It always gets me that sentence. Sounds like it's going to say that they've got them all. Uh, it's real most stunning. I believe you have a natural talent for finding fossils. I'm rather jealous. I hope I can perhaps convince you to assist with Morinan's cultural education. In the meantime, I shall return this to you. Do you think about donating, though? Hoot. May I offer any further assistance? Make a donation. So we just, I like to hand everything over just in case I'm silly and think that like these two foss, uh, these two bugs here are the same when they're not. So I always just highlight everything anyway. Uh, oh, it looks like those um, Cyclomatus stag beetles, whatever they are. We've already handed one over, it looks like. And one out of the two fossils they need, so that's good. Oh, several things I see. Let's take a look, shall we? Yes, we'll gladly take these off your hands. Ah, there's no need for you to pull them all out. I'll handle the rest from here. Also, you're donating multiples of the same item, but we only need one, so you may keep the extra. We pride ourselves in exhibiting all donations in a timely manner. Thank you very much. Thank you, Blathers. We've got time to quickly run back to retail. I mean, it's getting close to closing. Oh, a Plessio Torso. That's not what we want. Um... We want the t extra T-Rex pieces. All, all mammoth piece pieces. They're, they're just as cool to kind of build in the house. Uh, look at all the shops are shut. Apart from Digby on patrol. Okay, so we should have time. What's the time? Four minutes to get to retail. Go, 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 go. Hey, Wolf League, you're up late. We might as well pick up some fruits. We can one, two, three, four, five. Five pieces of fruit while we're here. Three, four, five. There we go. We've got to sell them at some point. Whew, made it just in time. Oh, hello there. Welcome. Hello. Do you like my new hat, by the way? Yes, how can I help you? I want to sell. You want to sell something, do you? Uh, what did you bring in? Pretty much everything except the gyros we're just going to keep and the spade. There we go. Is everything, uh, this everything? I'll start crunching numbers right away. Well then, I could probably part with 47,000. That's more than we made on the turnips, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> by, by the time we took into account what we paid for the turnips originally. So one tiny trip where we didn't even catch that many bugs, we've made more money than on the turnips. That is crazy. I guess turnips are only worth it if you actually get one like we did, I think in the very first week where it was like 400 or something. 
Uh, but since then, if it's only 100 or something, it might even be worth just spending the time bug catching. Okay, what time is it? Do we get kicked out? Three minutes. Ooh. Um, let's see if we can put a gyroid on here. Ooh, would you like to put something up in the flea market space? I would, actually. Sure, you're more than welcome. Would you? What would you like to sell? Um, Howloid or Weedingloid? <laughs> I think the Howloid. I'm pretty sure we've got one of those already. Howloid. For how much? Um, they're suggesting 828 bells. So let's make it uh, 1,000... 282 bells. <laughs> Alright then, I'll stick a price. Oh, that's scary. Stick a price tag of 1,282 bells on this item. If it sells, I'll put money straight into your savings account. I hope we can find your item new home. Ooh, I wonder if the villagers can buy uh, buy them from here. Okay, we've, we haven't got much time. I'm just curious, really, um, to see if we get kicked out of retail. Uh, do you know the reason why I come here, Maury? It's because sometimes you can find really amazing furniture at even more amazing prices. I always come here expecting that sort of exciting discovery. Come over here. Look, text. Come and buy this gyroid. I'm going to push you all the way there until you buy it. It's a friendly push, don't worry. Look. Look at this scary gyroid. <laughs> it would suit your home perfectly. Oh! Look at this gyroid, Tex. <laughs> Oh, he's walking away! No! Where are you going? Are you leaving? Some people think, uh, may think that items here are pricey and others may think otherwise. What may be very special to me might look like a total piece of junk to someone else. You're not wrong. Okay, I think... We've got less than a minute left, so if this goes to 11, I'm... We obviously will stay in here afterwards, but if if not, I'm, I wonder if they kick you out. That's what I want to see. We're just waiting. It's a matter of time. <laughs> I mean, if we fill this place with gyroids, someone's got to buy one. Oh, it's 11! The bell is going. The clock is ticking. Or talking. <laughs> All right. Uh, are there any new items here to get me feeling all excited? I guess not. I guess we don't get kicked out after all. That's a real shame. That would have been funny to see what Reese would have to say. Um, but yep, yeah, thank you for watching this far. If you did, thank you to the channel members. I hope you're still enjoying this series. Uh, let me know any feedback you have or anything you would like us to do. We've still got a whole bunch of things to do. The designs, paths, interior design. We've got um, countless things to unlock. Town tune, um, a flag we need to design. We want to get all the Astro stuff um, customized. So... Plenty to look forward to, I hope. Um, yeah, thanks for watching, and I hope you have an awesome day, and I'll see you next time. Bye!